What's up, you fucking toilets overflowing with shit? You fucking bastards. Where's my fucking money at? Get in here and pay me, motherfuckers. <laughs> I'm broke. Come on. It's ridiculous. Where's the donation? Zero people, man? Zero people means zero donations. Get in here and give me money. <laughs> What's up, sluts? Damn, that was a fucking quick-ass fucking 13 people. What's up, bitches? Here, let me go upstairs real quick and grab my glasses, because I keep forgetting I can't see. Uh, let me, let me do that real quick. So I picked it up, bitches, and I, you know, I gotta be honest here. Um, this might be, like, just as good as Mega Man 11. <laughs> I haven't played this before. This is the first time i played this. Um... It's good. It's like really good, and I kind of just, I don't know, I'm a little unnerved because this might be better than Mega Man 11. I haven't quite made that full determination yet, but I played both of them. I'll tell you right now, the soundtrack is definitely better. Fans since 2009, man, that's, that's insane. I can't even believe it's been that long, guys. It blows my mind. <laughs> Fans since 1927. <laughs> It's like, okay, well, I didn't exist, neither did YouTube, but good to have you as a fan. <laughs> yeah, Feet of Sarah Silent Rob was way better, dude. Way, 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 way better. My content was way better when I was six months old. <laughs> I just imagine, like, Roberto Hung porn director done by me at, like, six months old. Motherfucker, I had the gift even back then, dude. What the fuck? My dick was the same size, too. My dick was the same size. It's, it's, it's been full grown since birth. <laughs> Mom gave birth to me. They're like, oh, oh my god, there's another, you're giving, there's another baby in here. Like, oh, nope, it's just his dick. Never mind. You know, that happens. Yeah, listen to this song, guys. This song is better than anything in any Mega Man game since Mega Man 3. I posted this on my Facebook. Listen to this shit. I gotta turn on my TV a little bit. Uh, uh. What the fuck? What happened here? Why didn't they get this guy for Mega Man 11? This guy was like, a, this guy's a chip team guy. Why wouldn't they get this guy? This should be in Mega Man 11. Why wouldn't they? Can you imagine playing how much better Mega Man 11 would feel and play with this song playing in the background? It's fucking amazing. I was, I was like, I've been flipping out for the past two days driving Ani crazy because I keep playing this song over and over again on my phone and shit. I didn't know about this. Uh, Mega Man, Mega Man 11, man, like I said. It's good, okay? But, I was talking to my brother about this. My brother hates it. Like, he was just, like, he was telling me, he's like, dude, I don't like it at all. He's like, I'm actually kind of upset about it. And he's, I'm just like, why? I mean, it ain't that bad. And he's like, giving me his reasons. And his reasons actually make sense. He just, a lot of it is like, he just don't really feel like they did anything with it. You know what I mean? Like, they just should have done more with it. The the weapons and the, the slowdown, you don't really have to use that much. Like, nothing. Like, it's, for me... What kills Mega Man 11 more than anything... I thought the game itself was good. But what kills it more than anything is that soundtrack, man. I'm telling you right now... Mega Man... I remember the Mega Man games... More through the soundtracks... And how, how everything kind of syncs up... And becomes its own thing... Even more than the gameplay. Because it's like... It's nine games that are essentially the same thing. Okay, like, the series isn't, you know, people like the series, yeah, they're fun games, but people like the series because of what they are and how they feel and the, the soundtracks and everything like that. They, they, that's what they like the most. And Mega Man 11 soundtrack is just not good. Like, it's just not good. Earbuds. I, I don't like earbuds. Uh, I don't like putting things into my ear. Motherfucker. Unless it's dicks. <laughs> Oh, fuck that shit. I ain't putting. I don't like putting things in my ear. I have kind of an earwax problem, anyways. Um, I my ears make a lot of fucking earwax. Like even the doctors have said, like, God damn, you know what I mean. So I have to like clean my ears out and shit constantly, because I always got that shit going on, bitches. It sucks. 
I wonder what Boo Kitty's doing right now. She's probably got kids and fucking everything else. Who knows? I can't remember if she was, if she wanted kids or she ever talked about kids. I don't think she really did, but who knows? I literally haven't spoke to her, um, probably since like 2011 or 10. No, it's probably been 2009. It's been a long fucking time. Like I said, she's not, uh, she's not a bad person. She's just stupid. And gets in with really stupid people that... You know, like, she, she's one of those types of people that acts like whoever she's with. You know what I mean? So if she's hanging out with somebody that is a douchebag, she's gonna act like a douchebag. Um, she just kind of does that to kind of fit in with them or whatever. That's, that's what I remember most about her. Like, so she was hanging out with, like, uh... Like, Archfiend and this other guy I couldn't fucking stand. I can't remember what his name is. And she knew I didn't like those motherfuckers, but she, like, continued to hang out with them, and she started acting like, you know, and those guys weren't big fans of me, so then she started acting like a fucking total bitch towards me, you know, just because it's like she's, you know, hanging out with, talking to Arch Fiend and this other guy all the fucking time. I can't remember what, you guys know what his name was, I can never remember his fucking name. So, you guys all know people like that. People that don't have their own, like, personalities and they just kind of have to act like whoever they're with. It's fucking annoying. That was her. That was her for sure. Oh, man. These fucking warp things. Doesn't even need to be there. Wasting my time. Roach. I, I just don't talk to him. I'm not sure what he's doing or what he's what's going on. You know, that's one thing. You know, a lot of you young guys, you know what I mean? Like... A lot of us older guys can tell you, but, you know, a lot of you guys are just getting out of school, and, you know, you got these friends that you, you guys think you're going to be friends forever. Oh, man, our kids are going to play with each other's kids, and, oh, man, we're going to get buried. We're going to get a casket together, man. We can we can hang out even in the afterlife. Like, nah, bitches, it don't work that way. <laughs> you know what I mean? It just doesn't. These friends, are, they're gonna get their own lives, they get their own kids. As soon as they fucking get a girl and they get a kid, it's over. I've had that happen several times with several friends, man. They just, they disappear. Their girls got total fucking control over them. And they're whipped like a mofo, dude. You know? Or they choose, they choose to fucking move away, or who knows, you know what I mean? Fucking shit's crazy. That's why, you know, like, when, when Punk kept talking about these people he went to school with, like, 15 years ago, I'm like, dude, how do you even remember these people, dude? Like, I literally could not tell you probably the names of most of the mofos I went to school with. Like, uh, high school is, is such a small part of your life. That's why it's stupid when these kids fucking, you know, like, they make, they think high school is like the end of the world. It's not. It's nothing. High school's four years of your life. Motherfucker, I've taken dumps that are longer than that. I've literally been on the toilet for longer than four years taking horrible Taco Bell shits. Okay? Give me a fucking break, motherfucker. I mean, shit. <laughs> think about uh, think about 2012 and all like you guys remember my classic 2012 shit. That was six years ago, bitches. So that's high school plus two years. And that just seems like it just happened. So don't even get me started. You know, fucking break, man. I've literally wiped my ass longer than four years. You guys know you have those, those turds and they break in half. Then you're wiping for like two and a half fucking years. Okay, those are the worst. I had one of those the other day, man. I almost fucking ended it. I was like, I'm done with this. I've gone through 13 rolls of toilet paper. Like, what is this? There cannot possibly be any more shit on my ass. You know it ruins your day when you get a fucking turd break, man. Oh, you're like, fuck! <laughs> you gotta cancel all your plans for the rest of the day. You call them up, you're like, I'm not gonna make it. I'm like, it's your wedding, dude. How are you not gonna make it to your wedding? I got a turd break, dude. Turd break. And they're like, fuck. I'm like, I'll cancel the fucking catering and everything else. It's ridiculous, man. I hate that shit. Alright, those, those turd break fucking shits are the worst. You can just basically dig in the other half of the turd. Out of your ass. You can't do nothing about it. I gotta not lose concentration, man. Like, that's one thing about this. Like I said, is that I'll just lose concentration. And I'll think I'm playing Mega Man. Like, this place is so close to Mega Man, it's almost scary. Like, 
and I'll just die, and I'll forget that you only get one fucking hell, one, one fucking life. I've done that like twice now, so I gotta keep my concentration up. Oh god, I hate this boss. This might be the run ender right here, bitches. I'm gonna try. Game face. Oh, I don't know what's happening. I don't even know what's happening. What's happening? What the fuck even was that? Did I win? Did I... Was, was this, is this real life? I was just fucking praying that I wasn't getting to get hit. I was just like, I was like, fuck it! Fuck it! I was hammering that fucking attack button so hard, man. I about had a stroke. Oh my god. I don't know what this is because I never got this far before. So, I'm gonna... Whoa. Game face. Oh no. Okay. I didn't know what that was for a second. About to touch those spikes. That would have been... What the fuck is this shit? No way, man. Oh man, I gotta do like little mini baby jumps. Oh god. Oh sweet Jesus. I was gonna get hit at least once there. I was like, fuck it. They give me a thing to get some health back, I'll be okay. Oh no, eat a dick. Oh no! What the fuck is even happening? Oh, my hopes and dreams are being shattered right in front of my face. Oh, end it. Oh no! What the fuck? This is insanity! Oh no! Is this the last boss on this? Jesus Lord. Holy crap. No! I need health real bad! God, this fucking game takes the disappearing blocks thing to a whole nother fucking level. What is this now? Eat a fucking bowl of dicks. God damn, son. Oh! Wish they did more with this upside down shit, man, because it's really fucking cool. What is this? What the fuck? What the fuck? Oh no! No! Oh god! That was a good run, though. God, that was a good run. Fucking damn it! Look at that nonsense! No shit, guys. I, I was like, fuck that.